Oh, you! Back with us this term. Have you registered with me already? How was your vacation? I, I, have we talked about this? Uh, yes, uh, this is my final term. Yes, you, I chose you as my advisor for my senior project, so I'm registered already. It wasn't a vacation, though. It was a leave of absence because I needed to save money to come back with a vengeance. And no, we haven't talked yet. Am I interrupting? Yes, of course you are. But all the other students have taken the to the last minute to to register. Ah, guilty as charged. Sorry, I, I wasn't sure I was able to afford the time. No, you're one of the good ones, so I'll, I'll let it slide. So, Anyway, this is a social visit. I wish you would be able to uh, postpone until next week. So we, I'm no, so busy. I'm so I busy. actually wanted to talk about my senior project. Are you still making it about your brother's case? Yeah, you would think that, right? But uh, Nick is coming out soon. Already? Yeah, yeah, time flies. And I'm thinking I should move on and work on something else. Cool down your jets, space girl. Because the way I look at it, you have a full and free access to the mind of a killer. You've been working on this for years, so this might be your chance to write the book that you're always talking about. Well, we've never been close, at all. Still, I, I think that having your brother nearby is, is the best opportunity. Well, I think it'd be too personal. Let me be blunt here. You're not a normal person, you never have been never will be. Please don't take offense at this. Uh, I, when it comes to that, I'm the worst one of all. But you have to be comfortable with yourself and move beyond that. Just remember that you can see things the way other people cannot. So, shying away is not going to help you or anybody. You're Imagination will set you free. Why would it be different this time? I was thinking more about his feelings, but I mean, you you got a point. I, I have a point. You come here just for the pep talk, is it right? <laughs> Pitch it to me. Rough is fine. Just shoot. Passion crimes as a gateway to serial killing. Wow, we I love it. But do you think your brother's gonna kill more people? I, I was actually thinking of using him for the passion crime part. I am sold. Iron it out and send me the layout. Well, I, I didn't say I'd do it. I I want to see what happens when Nick gets back. Well, come back when you make up your mind, okay? Bye now. Will do. Thanks. Do you want to sit down or do you rather walk? Did you kill her because she preferred me? That was going to be my line, but uh, it turns out you didn't do it. Do you have any leads? What bothers me the most is that you don't even bother to deny that you've groomed her since middle school. The cat is out of the bag, as they say. Are you really going to judge me because I like the same girl that you and the whole school like best? Please. She could have been your daughter. But she wasn't! I loved her in ways that you can't even imagine because you're so young and stupid. She didn't pick me because I'm a trophy. She, she sought my company because she enjoyed it. Can you say the same? Apparently many people can. Not really. I think she dumped you and you lost it. Did you even know her? I lived with her. For like six months... The time to, is now to stop comparing dick size, <laughs> Nick. We need to work together if we're going to find our killer. You start. What can you share? 
I think that in the beginning, she was just fooling around, exploring. Then she started trying girls. One, two, and something changed. She wanted to have children. What did you say to her? That we were too young. That's why I think the killer is a girl. She probably tried focusing on getting pregnant and the girl just lost it. That's stupid. It makes total sense. The guys she got together with were trash. The girl must have been offended. Exactly. If she had a girl, she wouldn't have seen those guys as a threat. If Gwen had gotten pregnant, one of those guys could have been part of her life forever. The girl had every right to be worried. That's a nice theory, but she didn't have a girlfriend. What about Katie Morrison? She was right under your nose and you never even thought about it. Say what you want, but you're still the main suspect. The way I look at it is this. You haven't killed me either because A, you don't have it in you, or B, you don't think I did it. It would be good to get hold of her and see what she knows, if she was Gwen's girlfriend. The answer is B, for now. I'd go for C, all of the above. <laughs>